Okay, today let me show how to connect the crush drivers. A uh, crush driver is called a Android table PC. Uh, first, uh, we need to connect the hardware. So, the important thing is the printing connector. Uh, this port is connected LAN port from our routers and Wi-Fi loaders and then this one don't need connect because maybe we need to later right? we, uh, we need to use this USB cable later because we need to uh, configure the IP address now we can connect now it's okay and uh, this one is uh, connect our cache drivers okay this is hardware connect after you connect this, the hardware is okay. Then we need to try. Print. First, we need to print in the uh, sector, print the sector page to check the printer IP address. Now we need to power off and the key plus B and the power off. The printer will print in the sector test page. And there will be show the IP address. So this IP address is this one. Okay. Uh, and the last way, the second setup we need to set the IP address. It's the same our library for the printer. Okay. Uh, then we try to uh, check IP address. What is IP address in my local light bulb? So we need to try to use the common C and D and use the IP configure. Common. And then we below the IP, where we see the wire because of my PC, my laptop connected by. Uh, Wireless Wi Fi, so we need to check the Wi Fi's IP address. IP address is uh, uh, this one. This Wi Fi IP address is uh, IP, this one. So my key, my printer is uh, this one. So this is a different light bulb. So why we need to change the IP address as the same our light bulb. So we need to then we need to because my local is one and uh, my printer is uh, three. So this is a different. We need to because IP address must keep the first uh, segment first uh, three first three segments must C. so we need to change the IP address three to one on for for the printer if you print uh, uh if you PC which one you will piece use which one number for the setting which one number for printer okay let me we need to um, you say printing setting tools to set the IP address for the printer. Same we use the tools connect the light and choose the insert insert use a fixed IP address. See because my PC my PC is one and the printer is a three so I need to change the this will one and also this one so we need to connect set the printing will be bigger then that means set, uh, setting successful so now we can we also can try to print in a separate test page again okay now the IP address is a change See, this is before, this is now. 
show. Okay, uh, we can try to use the PC to pin this IP address, this branded IP address. CMD PING one a one my a point one six a point one point. That means it's connected because there have some some date reply from the printer. So we can try again power on and uh, try again. See, they are required time out. This means cannot uh, to pin this IP address. So that means my uh, printer is connected to our network. So we can, this printer is working. So now we can use our then use the ten use the table to first we need open the table to connect the Wi-Fi and said so because I said I, I, I said the Wi-Fi before is connected successful. So I don't show. Uh, so I don't show you how to connect the, the Wi-Fi. But it's okay. Then after connect, we can open the software. And when you open the software, we, you need to uh, register a new account for your store. And then uh, because we have uh, registered before, so that is okay. We 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 can try to uh, open. Okay, then after I can set in the printer, go to the setting and the printer and add new. The slave is anyone. It's okay. The printer, we can choose another model and the interface is inserted. Type the printer's IP address. One life eight sorry two point one six point one point this size is right, don't need to change. Open open when the order printing automatically okay same that means connect successful the printer is working okay I will see now I, we need to connect the scan Bluetooth scanner the type the setting and connect the device the choose the uh, uh, choose the the Bluetooth and then we can open the scanner. Keep touch the key and the when the scanner flashing that means the scanner is uh, uh, working. And then we try to connect the Bluetooth. This one is a uh, Bluetooth scanner. That means it's connected. Okay, next next setup we need to return the software. See? The printer and the scanner are connected. Now we can test it. Go to the sales and choose oh. because the battle we we, we said before we set, set up on the software before, so we just need to test it. So we can scan it. We 
you see this one is uh, shoot there. We change it that one. That means show on here. Okay, we can change. See, this one is a show is successful. Okay, uh, this wall is uh, working. Okay, done.